today's session i'm going to cover uh, screen scrapping okay so already we covered data scrapping and so there is one more option we have a screen scrapping so here you see uh, there is a tool tip and extract data from a specified ui element or document using full text native or ocr method okay so if i say screen scrapping so for example let's say we have a uh, application okay on the application we have a content but if you are using data scrapping or any other ui uh, activities uh, if using that particular ui activities and if you are not able to extract that particular uh, uh, content then you can go for uh, screen scrapping it is a screen the content available on the screen but you cannot copy it you know copy paste it uh, easily okay so i will show you an example so here you see i have a application okay so this application so if i need these particular uh, words okay and if i want to copy this words definitely i cannot copy this okay i think for this application you can use get text so assume that this is the application uh, this is the screen and you you know you need to uh, capture something okay using uh, screen scrapping method okay and uh, now go back to ui path studio and create a new sequence that is screen scrapping okay now so now i am i want to uh, extract the data of this this panel okay and uh, so go here and click on the screen uh, scrapping okay and just highlight uh, the place the content what do you, what um, what do you want then uh, i'm going to highlight this entire uh, panel from transaction configuration the entire panel uh, since i need this uh, content okay click on this and you see so it extracted all the uh, information on the screen okay you can see here and uh, yeah so deposit with travel split deposit and configuration then followed by all the information extracted okay and on the screen scrapping uh, i mean scrapper wizard so there is an option like native full text and ocr so now in this session just uh, uh, go, go with the native i will you uh, know um, give you the difference between full text and OCR later and as of now understand what is native okay so native is nothing but it will like, extract the entire uh, content okay from this uh, uh, window okay and also you have a uh, scrap uh, scrap options okay no formatting it will extract uh, your data with no formatting and also if we click this get words info okay if you click refresh and you see the transaction uh, this is the screen coordination okay so the transaction which is available in this particular uh, uh, screen coordination and the deposit available in this particular coordination okay so there is a reason there is an more option to get word info okay for all your words you can get your uh, uh, screen uh, coordination okay and from the screen and where that it is a position of your key okay your word and there is a one more custom uh, separators let's say uh, let's let me go back and refresh here you see uh, eliminate uh, there is a dollar and two if i want to just uh, separate that particular word i can give dollar here for a uh, um delimiter okay then click on refresh now you go and see the eliminate you know, it has a, a different coordination the dollar it has a different uh, a screen coordination okay so these are the option which is available on the native uh, screen uh, scrapping method okay so the one thing is um, no formatting so as it is you know we can extract and you can use uh, using this dirt board info you can get a screen coordination and using the custom uh, separator you can uh, split your uh, 
word and we will get uh, the screen coordination for that splitted uh, content also okay so this is how this uh, screen scrapper is a native uh, method will work okay then click on finish or else now i am going to use only uh, no formatting then click on refresh uh, if i un un uncheck this it will be like this only click on uh, no formatting and click finish okay now you see uh, it is done okay it's uh, extracted uh, the data using the screen and then it will be stored into this variable okay if you want you can change your variable also okay and here you see the variable type is it's uh, generated as a generic value so since no because uh, there is no proper uh, we cannot identify whether it is a string or uh, integer or uh, some other data type so that is the reason so it's a it's a taken as a generic value data type if i say generic value so we it will accept all the data types okay then uh, if i want to write uh, the same content into notepad you can write it let's say uh, this is done and i'm going to use uh, write text activity drag and drop and uh, so what you want to write here on your text file just uh, type your uh, content and then uh, where you want to write so i want to write it somewhere uh, some untitled dot uh, txt file okay txt file that's it and uh, now i'm going to execute my application is here and i'm going to execute this uh, click on run file so it's done and uh, let's go back to project panel and uh, check your uh, file untitled txt so here you see the notepad the data uh, captured from the screen and transferred to your notepad okay so this is how the screen uh, scrapping method will work